Hello everyone, I am Sir Zipsy Corpus of Campiña National High School, your teacher presenter for Teletaroan. At this point, you are already very familiar with const in constructing a circuit. The question is, how will you find out if connecting loads in different ways would affect the current and voltage of the circuit? Which connection is better to use? What are the advantages and disadvantages? Okay, let us start with the circuit diagram. Series circuit is described when electrons have to flow through one part to get to the next part. More components, more resistance. Increasing resistance, decrease current flow. Less current, less bright bulbs. As voltage increases, current increases. In a series circuit, there is one current path. All resistors have the same current. In a series circuit, the total voltage drop across the resistors equals the sum of the individual voltages. Remember, the greater the power actually used by a light bulb, the greater the brightness. The power rating of a light bulb is indicated for a given voltage. At room temperature, and the bulb may be in a circuit that doesn't have that voltage. What are the advantages and disadvantages of a series circuit? Problems with series circuit. The more devices or resistors in a series circuit, the less current passes through or it produces beamer bulbs. If one resistor breaks, a bulb goes out, the entire series is turned off. Resistors resist the flow of electrical current. It increased resistance will reduce the rate at which charge flows. Total resistance goes up with each resistor since the current must go through each resistor. Series circuit in terms of current. In a series circuit, a current can just disappear or appear. Since only one path if some electrons flow through, then they have to continue flowing from the other resistors. Since the current is the same through the entire circuit, in a series circuit, the higher the voltage, the faster electrons will flow through the conductor. Each component has resistance that causes a drop in voltage. In a parallel circuits, there is more than one current path. The voltage across the resistors is the same. This is an overview of series parallel circuits. What are the advantages and disadvantages of a parallel circuit? Advantages The more devices in a parallel circuit does not decrease the current. If one resistor breaks, the rest do not. Disadvantages Current doesn't stay the same for the entire circuit. So energy is used up quicker. So the total current increases, faster electrons, hotter wire, which may sometimes cause fire. Once again, let us differentiate series from parallel circuits. Series circuits, electrons only have one path to flow through. Parallel circuit, there are multiple paths for the current to flow through. Series circuit, all in a row, one path for electricity, one light goes out, and the circuit is broken. Parallel circuit, many paths for electricity. One light goes up, out, and the others stay on. Which is better, series or parallel circuit? Parallel circuit open more advantage than series circuit. Most things are wired in parallel because of the fact that the more you plug in, the intensity doesn't decrease. Of course, this also increases the risk of fire. This is why homes have fuses or circuit breakers. They turn off everything in the circuit when current moves too fast. Thank you for your active participation. I hope that you learned a lot. This has been Sir Gypsy Corpus of Campino National High School. See you again next time. Goodbye.